Hello my YouTube friends, this is Shannon from Southern Prepper Life bringing you an episode of my Sam's Club haul. Um, if you've been on my channel before, thank you for joining me again. And if you're new to my channel, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel and hit that notification button. I really appreciate your support. Please help me get to a thousand likes. Right now I'm just at about 30 likes, 30 subscribers rather. So please help me to get to a thousand subscribers by subscribing to my channel. Okay, let's get into it. So today I have made a few purchases at Sam's Club. And here on the end we have some uh, clover, proud clover honey. Um, it is a two pack, a member's mark brand. I believe the pack was $12, $12, $13. Um, I'll try to include some of the prices. I can't remember all of them. But I'll try to, uh, what I will do is put the prices on the screen. Uh, so that's some honey there. Uh, we're some tea drinkers around here, so we use a lot of honey. Here we have a three pack of bacon. It's a one, uh, three one pound packages of bacon for ten dollars. Uh, it's Members Mark brand as well. Um, they did have other packages for like twenty and thirty dollars. I wasn't ready for that, so I just stuck with the uh, ten dollar package. Um, here we have a four pack of unsalted sweet cream butter. Uh, there are four sticks um, in each box, um, and I'll put the price on the screen there, but I figured that was a good deal. Um, here, uh, this is not going into preps. Uh, <laughs> we're probably going to start eating those pretty soon, but I wanted some honey buns, so this is a box of honey buns here. I think they were just 4 or $5. Let's see, and there are 12 packs in this box. Here we have some Nikot or Nikot, I don't know how to pronounce that, uh, peanut butter cookies. Uh, these are for my parents. Um, they like these, and so I'm going to uh, take these to them. This is a 40 pack, so they really like those. Okay, next we have uh, a two pack of chicken fajita uh, meat here. Uh, this is two one pound bags I believe is what it says here so it's two one pound bags of chicken fajita meat uh, we like to make chicken fajitas around here so that can that'll come in real handy uh, here we have some daisy sour cream I didn't want to get the large bucket of sour cream so I just got these squeeze packets right here um, I thought they were very convenient uh, I'm getting ready to make some taco salad so that's gonna come in handy uh, here we have uh, the hardwood smoked pulled pork uh, members mark. It's a really good uh, two pound package. If you've never had this, you should try it. Um, all you have to do is heat it up in the microwave actually and add your own, own blend of um, barbecue sauce. And it is really good. It makes a really good pulled pork sandwich. All right. Back here we have our tilapia. I wanted to get some fish. Uh, so here we have a three pound bag of tilapia. Kind of gives some variety uh, in what we're eating so we're not eating the same things and get food fatigue. So we have some tilapia here and that's a three pound bag. And then we have the uh, Gordon's fish sticks. Uh, uh, it says it has 64 fish sticks in it. Uh, so I thought that would be good to get. Um, if you have children, that's a really good choice right there. Fish sticks and fries will really be a good meal for children. All right, next we have a 25-pound bag of all-purpose flour. Um, I believe that was about six or seven dollars, uh, and I have some food-grade buckets that I'm going to put this all-purpose flour in. Um, I also purchased a 25 pound bag of sugar and we already have that in the food grade bucket already. Alright next we have a 10 pound bag of the Members Mark Buttermilk Pancake and I think that was about five or six dollars. Um, I want to be able to store this in something um, so please if you have any suggestions on that uh, what would be good to store that in uh, I'm open to any and all suggestions on that. Uh, so we have the 25 pound or the 10 pound bag of 
buttermilk pancake mix by Members Mark. Uh, here we have a two pound bag of pecan halves. Um, if you buy pecans out of the grocery store, you know that these are rather expensive. And I think this bag was about 11 or $12. Um, I'll put that price on the screen, but this is a two pound bag of pecans. And then right behind that, we have a 25 pound bag of long grain rice. And I believe that was nine or ten dollars. And when I went to Sam's, they did not have that in Sam's. I literally had to order this bag of rice. But this is a 25 pound bag of rice. And I also have a food grade bucket for it as well. So I'll be storing that in a food grade bucket. All right, right down here, we have some kids' face masks for ages four and up. Um, if you have small children, you probably found out really quickly that the uh, regular masks do not fit their small faces. And so Sam's has these smaller masks for kids' faces. I believe it was about $5, $4, $5, it's 50 pieces in the box. And you could get those at Sam's. All right, then we have the, uh, the breakfast uh, cookie or breakfast biscuit uh, blueberry flavor by Belveda. Um, it's 25 packs in here uh, and it says it's nutritious and gives you steady energy. I've never had these so I decided I was going to try them out. So we're going to find out if it gives me some energy. Alright, next we have a one gallon container of Dawn dish liquid with the pump. Um, I thought that this was a really good buy. I think it was about twelve or thirteen dollars. Um, and this is the type of container that can be reused uh, with the pump. And I like my Dawn. I use my Dawn for a lot of different things. Uh, I make my tub cleaner with Dawn and vinegar. So Sam's has a one pound or one gallon, excuse me, uh, container of professional Dawn. It says professional on there uh, with the pump very easy to store okay next we have the palm toilet paper there are 45 rolls 473 sheets uh, per case um, if you're going to the store to purchase tissue right now you know that the stores are already um, putting limits on the tissue and when I went to Sam's the paper towel and the tissue area was pretty much empty I'm going to put a couple of pictures that I took at Sam's of where the tissue and the paper towel normally is. Um, this was on in another location in Sam's. I just happened to get that and they were low on this too. So if you're looking for tissue and you're going to Sam's, um, they have this tissue, 45 rolls, 473 sheets. The entire case was $20, but they only allow you to get one case. Uh, so if you're going to get tissue, you need to go ahead and go get that. All right, next I have a case of Sprites here. Um, I like Sprite. That's about the only soda that I drink. Um, and it helps my stomach out if I'm nauseous too. So this is, uh, I believe, a 24 pack of Sprite for, I believe it's 12 or 13 dollars. I'll put that price on the screen. Uh, just wanted to have something in the house to keep from having to go to the store so much. So went ahead and got that case of Sprite. I also purchased a couple of cases of this water. Uh, this is Nestle Pure Life. This is a case of 40 at Sam's for 3.98, I believe. Uh, right at four dollars and this is a case of 40 so I got a couple of those I did not see a limit on water at Sam's so that's that's a plus okay you guys so I didn't get too much at Sam's today uh, but this is my haul for this go around and again I'll put those prices on the screen for you so you can have an idea of what everything costs or what these things cost at Sam's. Again, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and share and hit that notification button. Help me to hit 1,000 subscribers. 
Thanks so much for joining me. Have a great day.